it's me Jill and welcome to your no equipment necessary workout. Today we're going to be focusing on the lower body, we're going to do a warm up and two great circuits followed by a cool down. Let's dive in. Today all you're going to need is yourself and a yoga mat. We're going to do a great warm up, we're going to do three exercises, jumping jacks, air squats and hand walk out to plank. We're going to warm everything up. Uh, let's begin. Three, two, one, let's go. Let's increase the heart rate. We want to wake up the central nervous system. Oh, nice big sigh. Let out all your stress. We're going to be here for one minute. If this is too much, obviously, you don't need to go this fast. You can slow it right down. Whatever music you've got playing, you can um, do your jumping jacks to the rhythm of that or to the music of this video. 10 seconds. And then we're gonna drop it into air squats. Okay, heart rate is up. Take a second. Feet just outside the hips. We're gonna drop the butt back and down. Fully extend. <sighs> Breathing. As we're doing a lower body circuit, we want to warm up quads, we want to warm up glutes, hamstrings, calves, and definitely the trunk. Good, take it at your own pace. Just stretch them out. You can sit at the bottom of the squat, press open the knees, chest up, just to really stretch the hips open. Great. Let's do three more reps. Three, two, and one. Perfect. Come to the end of your mat or wherever you're doing your workout. Hand walk out to planks. We're going to do this five times. Here's what we're going to do. You're just going to put your hands on the mat, bent legs, I mean, we're not contortionists. Hands on the mat, walk the hands out to plank position, squeeze, take a beat, push back, come to standing. Four more. Hands walk out, hit that plank, push back. That's two. Squeeze. And walk out to plank. Squeeze. Push back. And you've got one more. So just activating the core. Also warming up the shoulders. Hit that plank. And push back. Good. If you feel like this was enough, we've been warming up for four and a half minutes. You can maybe repeat this two more times and call it a day. Everybody's at different levels and I totally appreciate that. And I want you to make sure you're working at your level, not pushing yourself beyond that. This needs to be a new life journey. So take it step by step. If you are ready to push on, I wanna show you what we're gonna be doing next. We're gonna do a reverse lunge. We're gonna do a squat. And we're gonna do a um, Romanian deadlift. Three exercises which will all work the muscles of the lower body. So the first exercise we're going to do, feet under the hips. And when I say under the hips, my hips are here. A lot of people go wide. That's outside the hips. Under your hip bones, I'm going to step back, reverse lunge, neutral, reverse lunge. We're going to do 10 each side. Exercise number two, we've just done in the warm up. We're going to do a squat. Feet will be a little bit wider, nice and low. Stand, mind to muscle. So I'm going to be squeezing my glutes. As I come up, I'm going to actually actively squeeze them as if I'm cracking a walnut between my butt cheeks. We're going to do 15 of those. 
and then we're going to do something called a Romanian deadlift. Now a deadlift is a straight leg hinge which will really activate through having a really erect chest it will activate the hamstrings and stand, put a mini bend in the knees. If you don't feel it in the hamstrings, it can take a little bit of time to kind of, you know, make some adjustments, very micro adjustments, straighter leg, bender leg, Is your, are your shoulders rounded? Really imagine you've got a broomstick sellotaped to your back. You really want a tall chest and my body's in two parts and all I'm doing is hinging. That's, that's really all it is, is a hinge. But we're gonna do this without weight, so it's very much about listening to your body and really being in tune with feeling where you can feel the muscles being activated, where they're pulling and where you can feel them working. So let's dive in. Reverse lunge, 10 and 10, let's begin. One, and one, two, two. Nice and slow, this is for all levels. Three and three, modify, your knee doesn't have to go this far. Four, four, five, five, great. You can see my front leg and my back leg are both at 90 degrees. Six and six, seven, seven, eight, great, eight, nine, Nine, last one each side, 10 and 10. Slowly come up, feet just outside the hips, toes out, chest up. I always try to maintain a, a, a really tall chest, hands behind your head or in front of the chest. 15, one, two, three, four, five, six, Seven, eight, nine, ten, five more, five, great, four, three, two, one more, and one. Good, should feel a little bit of heat in the quads. RDLs, hinging forward, here we go. One, two, three, Four hands can be here, they can be here, or they can just hang down the front. Five, six, seven, good, eight, nine, ten, five more. Five, we go straight into round number two. Four, three, two, one more. Great, reverse lunge, here we go. One and one, two and two, three and three. Remember, you don't have to go this low. You can be here, four and four, five, five. Well done. Six, six, seven, seven, eight, eight. Nine, nine, last one each side, ten, and ten, brilliant, squat, here we go, toes just outside the hips, drop your butt back, and down for fifteen, one, two, three, four, five, remember, squeeze it on your way up, six, mind to muscle, seven, Eight, squeeze a walnut on your way up. Good, let's do five more. Five, four, three, two, one more. And one, good. Romanian deadlifts, and he turn to the side so you can get a better view. And hinge. One, two, three, Four, five, six, seven, add 
three, two, and one. Straight into our last round of reverse lunges. Here we go. how I do it. We're going to start with a curtsy lunge. Usually we would use weights for this. We do not need to. Our body weight is enough. It looks like a curtsy. Super simple. It really is just a cross the body squat um, lunge, like a split squat. We're going to do 10 one side, 10 the other. We're then going to take our foot onto the couch, onto the sofa, uh, or onto a box. And we're gonna drop it down. I just want you to make sure that your front knee is still at 90 degrees. We're gonna do 10 one side, we will switch and we will do 10 the other. And then after that, we're gonna do a plank, um, and I'm gonna plank on the box. So it kind of, um, I can just get some, maybe some little foot taps just working on some core, because it's all attached. My lower body doesn't just start here, it really starts from my belly button down. So let's begin, curtsy lunge. Three, two, one, we're gonna do 10 one side. One, two, this is working on the glutes. Three, outside of the hip. Four, five, six, seven, Eight, great, nine, one more, good, switch it over, one, perfect, two, three, four, five, six, seven, nine and one more this side and ten brilliant take your foot and our life toes flat not toes under here but whatever works for you hop forward down and up one two three four five six seven eight nine and ten good bulgarian split squats you are going to feel those tomorrow such a great leg strengthener no equipment apart from the couch one two 
inner thigh stretch and even if we hinge forward we will get a little bit of that hamstring as well also this IT band the outside of the thigh let's stretch that out come to neutral switch push open the knee great good come to neutral let's bring the feet in very gently quad stretch if you need to hold on to something totally fine if you get any knee pain a lot of the time it comes from having tight quads being quad dominant so always if you get knee pain very gently maybe have a tiny stretch of the quads or the thighs don't go crazy because we don't know if that's the real reason but you never know it has helped a lot of people some people have cartilage problems, but you can tell the difference between muscle and bone. If it's crunchy to touch, don't stretch it, go see a doctor. Good, let's take a nice deep breath in, bring the arms all the way up, let's stretch over, exhale, reach up, exhale, bring it over. Take a nice deep breath, push two big balloons all the way down, readjust your leggings. Really great job today, guys. Thank you so much for joining me. Brilliant. Thanks so much for joining me on this no equipment necessary circuit. I hope you feel empowered and stronger in the lower body. Look out for the upper body one. Don't forget to hit the button and subscribe, share, and I'll see you again soon. Bye-bye.